you were in a movie with Patrick Swayze. I was. Right? Yep. Yeah. And when you were young and he was something, huh? You were a huge fan. I saw Point Break on VHS. I've seen it over a hundred times. Okay. Really? Yeah. What is it about that movie that you would see it over a hundred times? That sounds so crazy. It's just so crazy. cool. I mean, the skydiving and surfing and Swayze is just so cool and Keanu. You and love it. I just it love it. It is a great movie. It's, it's it is. absolutely watchable. There are these movies that you just, it comes on, I just will always watch. We all have those movies, you know. And Roadhouse was one of those for you. Roadhouse. I mean, all of Swayze's movies, right? So when I worked with him on Donnie Darko. Man, like Your head must have exploded. Yeah, right? it's like yeah. fucking Patrick Swayze. Like, yeah. and <laughs> he was so so nice. He was so kind. I think at that point in his career, too, I think had a perspective on everything. I think he was, you know, he's happy to be there. And I remember him like he had the scooter that he would scooter to and from like set to base camp. And I remember being like, I was like, oh, that's such a cool idea. I got to get a scooter. Like, <laughs> scooters are cool right now, you know? Like, yeah. It was like yeah. he made a scooter cool. But, um, and then after that movie, him and his wife, Lisa, just so loving. Every time I was oh, they see them. St they stayed in touch with you? Yeah. And I, wow. I, I stayed in touch with Lisa. Like, I wanted to just check in with Lisa recently. And Did you, like, call her and say, hey, I'm, I'm doing a remake of Patrick's movie and... Just want I, you to know or something? Uh, I mean, yeah. Just reminding everybody what an incredible human being Patrick was. and That was a lot of fun, that movie. and Yeah. But, but your movie, man, well, your movie will do great. This, oh, it's so much fun to watch. 